Hey, you made it. You're here for a nice nail treatment. Okay, well, sit down. We'll have a little look at some colours and then we can get on with it. Today's video is sponsored by Madame Glam. Madame Glam offers over 1,800 beautiful gel polishes in over 800 shades and they launch new colours every single month. All of its carefully sourced salon quality polishes are vegan, cruelty free, palm oil free and have a 21 free formula which means they are free from the 21 most toxic chemicals found in nail polish. Madame Glam also offers all the nail accessories you could ever need as well as UV LED lamps and express press on nails. Plus they ship worldwide which means no matter where you are you'll be able to get hold of these beautiful nail polishes. I got to choose three gel shades from their Sokov gel polish collection and they came in this super cute kit along with a base and top coat and LED lamp. It was so hard to choose three but I went for Big Apple, Holographic Cat Eye and Sakura. So for all things nails head on over to their website. The link is in my description box along with a 30% off discount code. Thanks again to Madame Glam for sponsoring tonight's video. And let's go get your nails looking beautiful. So what kind of colour were you looking for? Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we have a very subtle pink shade. This is Sakura. You like that one? You do? Okay, well, this is this one here. It's by Madame Glam. It's a very beautiful shade. So yeah, I'm wearing that at the moment. You, we'll put that on the side as a maybe. Okay. What is the nail treatment for? Are you going somewhere special? A wedding? Night out? Okay. Would you like to look at something a little bit more glitzy? As an option? Okay. We also have this holographic cat eye. What do you think about that? It's beautiful. Yeah, it's really, really uh, glittery in the sunlight. So that is option number two. Okay, that's fine. The final option today is Big Apple. It's a beautiful bright green. You love that? Me too. Should we go for that one today then? Perfect. Okay. Can I see your nails then? Okay, I'm just going to have to take off the old polish first, okay? No, that's fine. That's absolutely fine. It'll only take me a couple of seconds. Okay. Okay, you ready? When was the last time you had your nails done? I mean, professionally. Okay, it's a little bit of a treat then. Yeah, I tend to do them myself as well. Okay. Good, let me see. Yeah, they're looking good. Okay, do you want them much shorter? Were you happy with them the length they're at? Just give them a little bit of a tidy up then. Is that alright? Okay. Yeah, I won't take too much off, don't worry. I just want to sort of reshape them. They look like they've caught a little bit. I went 
funny pinky shade on my nails because I'm going to a baby shower this weekend and it's uh, the girls and they want us to do a little pink theme. <laughs> yeah, I just wanted something subtle really. just helps the nail polish stay on. I know, mine chips a lot. I, um, I tend to rush things when I'm doing it myself, so it's nice to do it properly, isn't it? Okay. Okay, a nice. and dried first and then we'll give you a little hand massage to send you on your way we have got a really nice mint tingly one or a cucumber one so that will help cool your hands down a little bit more yeah yeah no it sounds good okay well we're ready to put the base coat on now for you okay yeah nice and comfortable Doesn't get too hot. Mm -hmm. I know I am really naughty and I don't do a base and a top coat very often at all. A lot of the time we don't have the time, do we? We really don't have the time to do it properly. Okay, they're good to go. You take those out for me. We'll do your other hand. good. When did that happen then? That's amazing. We've been celebrating. <laughs> did you? I've never done that. No, it's not something <laughs> that I would be overly keen to do. Fingers under for me. No, I'm not particularly, uh, what's the word? I don't like to risks. Mm. I like to keep my feet on terra firma. But good for you. That's one way of celebrating. Yeah. 
and more of a go out for a nice dinner and have a glass of fizz kind of celebration go. <laughs> I know. Yeah, we're going to be putting your chosen big apple colour on in a second. We'll do a couple of coats of that and then we'll put your top coat on last of all. And when that's dried, we can give you a nice little hand massage. Okay, you can take your fingers out. And let's grab your beautiful green colour. Okay, we only need a very thin layer. A very, very thin. These are vegan. Yeah, all of Madame Glam's nail polishes are cruelty free, vegan. And they do not contain toxic chemicals. Yeah, they're very kind. Very kind. Well, these just go on beautifully. It's like butter. Really, really lovely. A little goes a long way. It really does. Okay, ready? You're vegan? That's amazing. How long? <laughs> it's a start. Yeah. No, I'm not vegan. But I do eat a lot of vegan food. It's very yummy. I don't mind. I don't eat a lot of meat. But I can't say I'm fully vegan. And I eat a lot of cheese. So that's my downfall, definitely. <laughs> How's that feeling? It's beautiful. A really beautiful colour. I haven't tried this colour out yet on myself, but the next night out I have, I'm definitely going for the Big Apple. Okay, ready to do your next one? The other hand, yeah. Just need to get the excess nail varnish off. Okay, ready? Yeah, that's beautiful. This colour really, really suits you. Yeah. I wonder if it suits every tone of skin. I suppose it would. Yeah. I can't wear dark colours, like blacks or reds. I'm so pale. I suppose if I was going for a vampire, not vampire, vam vampiress, vampiress. I can't think of the word. But if I was looking for that kind of a look, then maybe. But I don't think it makes my hands look very nice. I think like a soft colour or a neon colour are my go-tos, definitely. Definitely, definitely. Have you ever had nail art on your fingernails? Yeah. Oh, that sounds really cool. I've seen some really pretty ones. No, I don't do that here. I don't do nail art. Um, I'd have to practice a lot first. Yeah, it is an art, definitely. Okay, let's do your second cut. me. Good. Oh, this is so beautiful. Honestly. Okay. Keep your hands 
help me. I know, but it actually dries them really quickly and it's perhaps a little bit of a faff at home. We're always in such a rush. We should slow down a little bit, shouldn't we? Mm. Are you heading straight off after this? You are. Okay. You want the massage? Yeah. Okay, good. You deserve it. Yeah, okay. And the second coat on your other hand. And then we'll do the top coat. After this. Just nice and protective. Now these are soak off gels so you need to perhaps come back to me and we can soak them off with alcohol it comes off pretty easily but you need to do it in the correct way otherwise it won't come off Pretty simple. But yeah, just come back to me and I'll do it for you. No extra charge, don't worry. Okay. That's why you need the base and the top coat. That's the kind of gel they are. Sometimes you get a polish that's all in one, but these you need the three. You need the three steps. So what colour do you think you'd go for next time? Like a natural, neutral colour? Like a nice sort of fawn? Yeah, taupe. I love that colour actually. It's a nice everyday sort of nail varnish colour. Yeah. Okay, we're almost done. We've just got the top coat to do. Okay, good. You want a little rest first? You want to have a little wiggle of your fingers? Have a little look at them. Hmm. They are. They're really beautiful. Okay. So now we have the top coat. The top, 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 top coat. Hmm. Okay. Let's get the excess off. I know, it's the same as getting your hair cut Super relaxing Or just having someone Play with your hair or It's just a nice feeling, isn't it? It always sets me to drift off as well Do you tend to get massages a lot? No, I know. It is a real treat, a real luxury. Used to get them a lot in my twenties. But now it's definitely kind of a birthday treat. What's your favourite? Oh, I like a nice lava shell. Yeah. And they're like hot, hot lava shell. It's so good. And I tend to go for quite deep tissue massages. I don't really get much out of aromatherapy massages. They're obviously very nice, but I want to feel like I've been pummeled. <laughs> Do your last coat. I really love reflexology as well. 
Mm, it's really interesting how they can tell which parts of your body are going through problems. Mm -hmm. Mm, yeah. was your last coat. Ready? You're looking forward to the massage. I'm not surprised. I'm a little bit jealous. <laughs> mm. So happy you're glad that you're happy with your nails. It's not normally a, a, a nail colour you'd go for. I think it's good to experiment, isn't it? Especially with things like nails because they're just like a little flash of colour. So it's uh, the perfect way to experiment. I think we are done. So I'll have a little look at them. I still wouldn't touch them for a little while. They may still feel a little bit sticky, but that's fine. Okay, right, well, let's give you your hand massage. Would you like the mint or the cucumber? You want the mint one? No problem. That will be the most dry, okay? Your hands do so much and we forget to treat them, don't we? Get to treat them. I think your hands and your feet deserve so much more love than we and we give them just pulling on each finger can close your eyes if you want. I don't mind. <laughs> it is super tingly and just cools you down. I love mint uh, cream on your feet as well. That's a really nice feeling when you've had a hard day at work. It cools them right down. week my yoga teacher would focus on one part of the body um, and when it was hand week I loved that so much you kind of gave yourself a little hand massage in the yoga session and then yeah it was all about um, I guess focusing on that part of the body um, to really release the tension. If you focus on that area then and breathe into the area, it actually really helps release all that tension and all that stress from that particular part of the body.
Yeah.